don't even, I'm too excited to even say, hey yo, what's up guys? But hey yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Right now I'm on my way to get my cast off. I'm sorry if I'm yelling and screaming and super excited, but I'm just super, super excited to get my cast off. If they tell me that it has to stay on or I have to get another cast for another four weeks, I'm honestly, I'm gonna cry, yeah. It's gonna be really depressing. I've been really looking forward to getting this off. I have some friends coming over later to swim. Obviously, I'll record that and then I'll actually be able to do swimming things. If you're new here, make sure you click that subscribe button, give this video a huge thumbs up. This is literally the last time I can make the joke that my thumb is always in a thumbs up position. So that means you guys have to hit the thumbs up. So I know it's a corny, stupid joke, but literally the last time I can make it. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to record in the doctor's office because when I got it on, they told me I couldn't, but maybe the reason I said I couldn't was because they didn't want me filming other patients. So maybe if I just tell them with my phone, like I won't bring in the camera, if I could just angle it so it's only filming me, like Kiana can hold it so it's just getting the cast off. Cause that'd be pretty cool to get put in there and then you know, obviously you guys will see what my arm looks like under here. Honestly, I kind of forget what my tattoo looks like underneath the cast. I, I remember what's there, but I don't remember the exact details, so I'm excited to see that. I'm not excited for the tan line, and I'm already <laughs> skinny, so I hope it's not super, like, super, super skinny. But we'll see. Kiana's birthday dinner is in two days from my time, which would be tomorrow, your guys' time. So with the permission of her and her family, I'm gonna record that so you guys can see all our family, do a little nice birthday, B-roll, whatever. Hey, then, I'm the woman that's in charge, so I say it's okay. All right, cool. <laughs> Actually, here, I'm just gonna give you guys a little rundown of the week of coming up of vlogs. So, I'm all gonna say it my time, so just know that okay, whatever yeah. day I say, it's one day later for you. But obviously, today I'm doing this getting my cast off Saturday. I'm debating whether or not I want to come up with a challenge or do a QFA, so you guys will just have to stay tuned until Sunday for that. But Sunday my time is Kiana's birthday dinner, so I'm gonna record all day preparing. Then at the dinner, Monday I'm doing the five pound gummy bear eating challenge with Chasen from my internship. So if you guys want to see that weird challenge, I honestly don't even think I can eat like two pounds of that. I mean, I feel like I'm gonna throw up maybe. But no, I'm not gonna actually though. Aww. We have 30 minutes to eat as much as we can, so stay tuned for that, that's gonna be really cool. It's also gonna be live streamed on their Facebook page, which is I think just Product Watch. I'll leave the link down in the description. Then Tuesday, Kiana and I are driving down to Dana Point to visit her uncles. It is her birthday on Tuesday. So remember, like I keep saying, go to her Instagram, Kiana Lichter, spam her with some birthday love on Tuesday, July 17th. But once we get there, we're going on a boat and swimming like in the harbor, and then we're going to Dave and Buster's later. Wednesday, we're going to Disneyland and California Adventure for Kiana's birthday, and then Thursday, we come home. So that's like the next week. It's honestly every single day doing something crazy, doing something big, doing something in general. So you guys really need to stay tuned for this upcoming week, all right? I know this is a long intro, but hopefully I can cut to inside the doctor's office. If not, then I'll cut to at home when I do the reveal of what my arm looks like. So, uh, yeah. I don't even know where to begin, to be honest. Um, I guess short answer, still have a cast. Well, I... I got to the doctor's office and Kiana and I were waiting. We walked up to the receptionist and I gave them my little slip and they're like, oh, you're getting your cast off today. And it was just building to my excitement. I mean, you guys just saw it earlier, how excited I was. And we were sitting there and then they called me and I went back and the nurse lady, she was like, oh, you know, let's get that thing off you. So I, I held my arm out. They took out the little blade and zzz, took it off. I saw my hand, you know, it wasn't too, it wasn't too bad. The tan, there was no tan line. It wasn't like all skinny from atrophy. It was just like all the, my hairs on my arm were like, it looked like they're all old and wrinkly and then my skin was super dry and some of it was wrinkly. A guy came up and they needed to take more x-rays. So he went, took x-rays and then he didn't say anything about it. Obviously the x-ray people can't say that. But then they took me to a waiting room, like a doctor waiting room and a different doctor came in I had a guy doctor not put the cast on, but when I went in the first time, he was the one that was like, told me it was broken, broken, that I would wear a cast for four weeks, and after that, I would either wear a brace or another cast for four weeks. So, but he said that it looked like I would only need a brace, brace like a splint, you know, something that come on and off. And 
this this other doctor walked in and she was looking at it and she said your x-rays look good it's healing properly um you know it's not going to require surgery it's it looks like it's healing good but you need another cast and honestly my heart like <laughs> my heart broke i looked over at kiana and she was looking at me and she could tell that i was like so sad because I was so excited to get it off. I asked the doctor, I was like, is it because it's not healing properly or it's something like that? And she said the plan the entire time. So this is what the first doctor didn't make it clear that with scaphoid injuries, or at least my injury, I would wear a cast for four weeks, get it off so I could take x-rays to monitor it, see how it is, and then wear another cast for four weeks, which is this one, get that one off, take more x-rays, but then wear a splint slash brace for another four weeks. So I guess the plan the entire time was to put another cast on, but it wasn't made clear to me the first time I was there because the doctor said you might not need it, like you'll probably just need a splint. So, um, yeah, that was, it was just heartbreaking. I had plans, you know, to come home swim. I told you guys, I was so excited that I can start doing things again. You know, I don't like, I don't like working at my job, but I was kind of happy to go back just to like experience it again and have an actual flow of income. And I was excited to actually eat normal because when I eat with this, think of like if you're holding a sandwich or a hamburger, you know, normally you'd hold it like this, right? But since I, I don't wanna get like grease and stuff on this, I have to like use my index finger and my middle finger, it's so weird and I can't write at all. I mean, you guys have seen some of my writing, it's really bad, I can't use forks. So I was really excited to get back into that. I was excited to swim. I live in SoCal, so it's so hot. And I have a pool and I haven't really been able to swim except for that thing. I just like I always say, I have to sit there. And I mean, I was just excited to be able to not be normal, but just go back to doing what I was doing and being able to go do crazier vlog things. Like I can't do the bubble balls right now because of this. I can't go do crazy stunts because of this. So it's like, I was really hyped and really excited and all my friends were excited for me. My family was like, oh, you know, like you're gonna get it off, blah, blah, blah. And I didn't get it off and now I can't work for another month. I mean, I guess it's a blessing in disguise because I'm still gonna be doing vlogging all the time. Even if I went back to work, I would still vlog every day. But I guess now I have more time to do it. I mean, I guess the best thing about this is I can, I can still make those thumbs up jokes. I don't like this cast because it, it first off, it's already dirty. Like the guy who wrapped it got, I don't know if you guys have got a cast on, but the actual cast itself is like wet when they wrap it and he got it all on this. Um, there's more of my knuckles showing. The other one went to like right here, but this one goes down here. The only problem is this one is longer. I'll use my tattoo as a reference. So if you guys are looking at my tattoo, it, the cast goes to the astronaut's shoulder before it used to go to his arm. So it was like right here. So the cast was significantly smaller and it was also thicker. This one's like skinny. And also this one's a lot tighter. So it's like pressing on my arm. So yeah, I'm sorry I did not, was not able to make a cool vlog for you guys. I got home yesterday and I was just like super depressed. So Kian and I really just hung out at home and just like watched movies and just laid there. Like I said earlier, this week is going to pick up. I'm still Recording Kiana's birthday dinner, gummy bear challenge, driving down to Dana Point, and we're going on a boat on the ocean and Dave and Buster is in Disneyland California Adventure, coming back. I have some challenges, surprises for you guys. Also that surprise and that surprise it's give you a hint, it's in August with a they and you know, like that. So you guys will have to leave your ideas down in the description. I'm having an old friend of mine old friend slash football coach, he's probably not watching this, but he is going to come and start in some of my videos. If you guys watch the Ace family, like their last vlog, when they got on the private jet, his name is Reggie. He was like the light skin guy with the beard and the earrings. I think Austin talked to him first when he came on the um, the jet. Yeah, he's my old football coach and friend. So I'm gonna have him come on. We're gonna do some crazy challenges, stuff like that. So sorry it's not super entertaining for you guys, but it's just I kind of needed the rest of yesterday to just get over my excitement and get over my sadness because I'm not someone who likes to just sit there and sulk. So I just needed to get all of it out because I used to, in the past, I used to like stuff my feelings inside and then one day it would just all come out and it'd be really bad. So I've, I've worked on bettering myself and be able to release my emotions when it's happening, like if something sad happens and I'm sad, 
be sad, not try to be like, oh yeah, no, I'm still fine. Or if I'm like upset or angry or something about something, I try to express it at that moment so it's not stuffed down and like eats at you. You guys know what I mean? So I just needed that little time to just slowly get over the, the sad part about having to wear another cast. But now I'm back, I'm better, I'm happy. I mean, I'm not like the happiest happy because you know, I still have to wear it and it's still, every time I look at it, I'm like, oh, come on. But I do want to get back in the swing of things. You guys are watching this today. Tomorrow, your guys' time, Sunday, July 15th, will mark the one month anniversary of everyday vlogging. That's what, 30, 30 to 31 videos in a row. It's been absolutely crazy. I can't believe I've actually been able to keep up with it. I'm having so much fun with it. It's crazy. I'm excited where this journey is taking us. So I guess now would be a good time to close out the video. I don't want to keep boring you guys with just straight talking. So if you guys are new here, make sure you do click that subscribe button. I know today doesn't seem like this channel is super lit, but trust me, we are the most lit channel on YouTube. That is a hardcore fact. I just want to give the quick shout out to Music Maniac. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Guys, if you want to shout out the new shout out system, subscribe to the channel, click that little bell button, give this video a huge thumbs up, go down to the comment section and just comment done. And with that being said, I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.